What's up? My name's Tech here for Troubleshoot and welcome back to another video. In this quick video, I'll be talking about how to get the old Windows 30 room in Windows 11. It brings back quite a few features and of course may be a bit better for you and your specific use cases. While the new photo viewer may have a couple of new features, work in a few different ways, overall I really don't like this UI. It's a lot slower to open, a lot slower to render big images, etc. I much prefer the old Photo viewer, that's just a lot easier to use in general, at least in my opinion for my use case. If you're like me and you'd like to get back the old Windows Photo Viewer, it's incredibly simple as it's still built into Windows 11 and of course will hopefully be built in in the future for quite a long time to come. All you need to do is look in the description down below for a download link to this registry file here, which I'll simply open up with Notepad as it's a simple text file with the .reg extension. When we do open it up, you'll see all of this text over here. Essentially, it just re-enables the Windows Photo Viewer and allows you to open it up. Pretty simple. This is all that it does. So if we simply double click in this, click yes, then OK. And the next time we go to open up an image, we should see Windows Photo Viewer from the drop down and we should be able to open it up in the nice old Photo Viewer as such. Of course, everything's exactly as you remember it with Windows 10 before the new Photos app was introduced and made the default. In order to get this to become the default on Windows 11, simply right click any image, then open with. And in this drop down, we'll expand this, choose always open and then choose Windows Photo Viewer and OK. When we do so, the photo viewer will open up and you can see the image over here. Though anytime we go to double click on a picture, you'll see that it opens up the image just like that. It's super simple, easy to get back. And of course, I just much prefer it to the current built-in photo viewer in Windows 11. This is just much better in my opinion. Anyways, that's about it for this quick video. Once again, you'll find a download link in the description down below. It's just a bit of text and you can verify that you've downloaded the right thing by opening it in Notepad first. Thank you all for watching. My name's been Technobi here for Troubleshoot, and I'll see you all next time. Ciao!